story time. Back when I first started organizing, I had a client who wanted help with her daughter's bedroom. She told me she couldn't keep it organized because of all the stuff she had in her room. So we created a plan for the toys, clothes, desk supplies, all of it. So we got rid of the junk, gave everything a specific spot, like all her doll clothes went in a drawer in her closet and the accessories fit under her bed. Less than a week later, that same client called saying her daughter's bedroom wasn't organized. So I asked some follow-up questions. What wasn't organized? What was bothering her? And I quickly found out that she didn't like all of the stuff in her daughter's room, which meant that it needed to be stored somewhere else. I missed the cardinal rule of organizing. Get really clear on what organized looks like for the clients. After that experience, I learned to always get a clear definition of what organized means, which is why we have to start this book talking about what organized means to you. Get your copy of Home Sweet Organized Home now and learn how to define organized for you.